And the Washington State Fallen Heroes Project held a time of remembrance over the weekend. Gold Star families, who are those who have lost loved ones who were serving our country, met over the weekend as they honored more than 300 of their fallen heroes. Camp KB's Margot Cady shares the memorial ceremony. This is our 15th year of time of remembrance. And what we're here is to honor and recognize our um, fallen heroes and their families, surviving families, Gold Star. Uh, we also have several of the, the guys that served with them. They've come down to you for this weekend. At first, when it first happens, you're, you're distanced from so many. You don't know what to think. You don't know what to do. Am I the only one who feels this way? And we've been able to bring together families from all across Washington, Oregon, and Idaho who have come in and joined our group for the weekend. And I think the most important thing is that they find out that there's somebody there who feels the same way they do. A lot of our families, when they meet each other, uh, there's no, you don't need to stand there and tell your whole story because you already know how they feel. Most of the time it's a hug and a tear and together you share what's happening. A beautiful ceremony there and to learn more about the local group time of remembrance and to get involved in additional ceremonies that honor our service men and women you can go to yaktrynews.com and thank you to those who gave the ultimate sacrifice.